also FarmBot. We do remote water monitoring for livestock. Um, and today we've got our, our, uh, our, our FarmBot monitor, our trough monitor, our rain gauge, and our pump control. So it's all some, some new products we're very excited about. So really uh, about remote water monitoring, um, you know, it's really about saving uh, farmers time, driving around, checking their tanks, but actually knowing how their water's going and working, making sure the stock's got water, making sure their pumps are working. So yeah, it's about saving them time and money and giving them peace of mind. I think the, the advancement in ag tech, um, but also uh, producers and their, their sort of acceptance of ag tech now. I know in the past they may have been a little bit sort of hesitant. Um, and I think now with the advancements in technology and also the, just the, the industry growth, um, I think farmers now have a lot more confidence. So they're really willing to, to adapt and adopt to, um, to you know, better ways of farming. So we've been working on a number of really interesting data projects with some producers, so sheep and beef. Uh, and so we're showing off a little bit of the work we've been doing, creating that uh, data convergence and creating reusability around that producer data, but better analytics and production and sustainability um, among other things. We also have a bunch of neat devices uh, that we're showing off and we've deployed a number on some uh, MLA projects. Um, weather stations and soil moisture probes and that kind of thing and we've developed an in-ground soil carbon probe as well and so we're showing that off a little bit as uh, something up and coming. I was just out the back there having a look at this at the Sky Kelpie drone. Uh, it's quite neat. I've already sent a little bit of video footage off to a couple of people. So uh, yeah that's a neat bit of kit. Yeah so we have Pear Tree which is really connecting data from across the entire farm. So ultimately what we can pull in is Sevo Labs satellite imagery, we can pull in OptiWay for our animals that are being weighed in the paddock, but then we can also have uh, AgriWeb or My Grazing and the livestock management software. So we pull all of those different bits of data together so that farmers can actually make that decision, then have a look at the markets to see when they should buy or sell and then make those decisions. So what we've got here is we can see how my farm is at the moment, what happened one, a month ago, and then what happened two months ago. So we can see the improvement in the grass and the growth within it. But we can quickly also then have a look at uh, what's happening with my OptiWay sessions. So we can see what the distribution of the livestock are, uh, what the weight are, how much weight they're still putting on at the moment. And we can have a look at what their, their, you know, their difference in their weights at the different times, you know, 408 kilos roughly average at that time and so all these little pieces of the jigsaw really come together and that's what sort of farmers are really trying to find that one spot there's some of these things that we can um, have a quick look at to um, have a look you know quickly look over your farm see where your, um, your tanks are see what position your tanks uh, whether they're full or empty and then we can quickly have a look at the different ones so we'll have a look at what the pasture is doing across the same farm so yeah Slowly by slowly we're starting to pull things together to make life easier.